What's going on everybody? My name is Mitch Tavian and this is going to be a PL SQL developer tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to import data into a SQL database from an Excel file. So I've created this Excel file here. Um, uh, these columns are user ID or employee ID, your employee name, the employee's email, and then the employee's uh, wage that they get per hour. So we're going to import this into a database. So the first thing we need to do is go up here and create an SQL window and create our table. So create table, we'll call it employees and our first column is going to be user ID and we're going to make it an integer and our second column is going to be our employee name and it's going to be variable character, 50 characters long. Our next column will be the email, and it'll also be a variable character. 50 should be enough, and then we're going to have the wage. And we'll make that one a numeric with eight total digits and two decimal places. It's because uh, that would mean, yeah, no one's going to be making more than $9,999 an hour, at least not the place I work. So that table should be fine. I've set it to hit, um, actually here, I'll just do it manually here. This is the execute button here. And if we want to check out our table just to make sure that we created it, we can go select all from, oops, employees. And we can see our table right there. So now we're going to go ahead and insert the data. So to insert the data, we go up to tools and go all the way down to ODBC importer. Here we click Excel file, connect, and we need to find our Excel file. So wherever you stored your Excel file, just find it and get there. And you can scroll down and check out a preview. So that's what it would look like. Then we're going to go over to the tab up here, uh, data to Oracle, find your uh, Oracle user. Uh, where is it? There we go. And then select the table. And in this case, our table is going to be the employees table. Looks good. Scroll down, check out the preview down here. Looks pretty good. I'm going to assign our fields. User ID, name, email, wage. Now this type will be this. Give that one a string, yeah, yeah, wage, remember. All right, it looks good. And then we just hit the import button down here and says 18 records imported cool so let's check to see if it actually imported i'm just hitting and hit the f8 key because i have it uh, set up as a shortcut so there we go and we can see our data got imported if you like this video don't forget to like subscribe comment and as always thanks for watching